Hey guys, welcome back to Andy's Dinosaur Reviews. We just had the final edition of the Collect Day 2020 announcements from Everything Dinosaur, and I am excited to bring them to you now if you have not seen them already. The very first one is one of their Supreme Deluxe figures, and it is a Cavi Ramus, a very interesting looking pterosaur. This is going to be yet another, as I said, a Supreme Deluxe, so it's going to be another very large pterosaur figure like the Dimorphodon that we had previously, and according to Everything Dinosaur, it's actually going to be a similar size to the Dimorphodon, which will make it quite the large figure, and I think that the overall appearance of this is absolutely beautiful, really nice looking crest. The colorations on this are really well done as well. I really like that green coloration, something I wouldn't have chosen for a pterosaur, but it actually looks incredibly well done on this figure and looks very natural. The pose and everything looks fantastic, I do believe, this will have an articulated jaw as well, so this is yet another of the many Collect A 2020 models that I will be extremely excited about. The next one is a Red Lichia Rex, so a trilobite, and I think that this one is beautifully sculpted, and I'm actually really happy that they decided to create a whole bunch of species like this, a bunch of marine animals, because previously we didn't really have too many of these coming from Collect A, and in fact I think the only ones I can really recall were in the mini tubes, so it's nice to have some larger scale versions of these figures, and this one is incredibly well done. I kind of expected not to like these as much as I am, but I am actually quite excited about these. The coloration, the sculpt, everything on this is absolutely beautiful, and it's yet another figure that I'm definitely going to be getting a hold of and reviewing here on the channel. Then the next is an Orthocerus, and yet again another absolutely beautiful looking marine animal created by Collect Day for the 2020 year. They are really overloading us with these, and honestly, again, just like I said previously, I think it's great because they are all absolutely beautiful, and I'm really quite excited to see just how nice they look in person. This one again is absolutely sculpted to the max and with beautiful coloration. Once again, this is another very highly anticipated figure for me. Again, it's not something that I normally would collect and I would usually not even try to go out of my way to get a hold of them because I'm not a huge fan of marine animals. I do like them, but it's nothing like dinosaurs and I normally end up spending all my money trying to obtain the dinosaurs and then don't ever get around to getting any of the marine animals that most companies release, but these Collect Day ones are just too good to be missed. Then we've got a Nautilus, and this one also looks incredibly well done. The coloration on this is just absolutely top notch, and out of all the marine animals that we got this year, this one actually might be my favorite. It's really leading the charge. I think that the paint apps on this are just off the charts beautiful. If it actually shows up looking like this, I will be beyond excited. But again, the sculpt is just absolutely fantastic. There is nothing but perfection when I'm looking at these new models from Collect Day. And this is again another incredibly beautiful looking figure, another incredibly beautiful looking marine animal, and I cannot wait to get a hold of this one as well. And then the final one, and it's one that many people were really excited about, really looking forward to, and it's a little bit of a disappointment, but at the same time not really. It is their Diplodocus. I don't know if this is deluxe or not, I actually might have to check because I didn't really check into that prior to making this video. I would like to hope so because we already had a standard version of this Diplodocus. And actually in this exact pose, I believe, it was definitely rearing up just like this one is. So I don't know if there's anything different about the pose until I actually break out my Diplodocus. But as of right now, what I'm seeing here, it really looks pretty much the same as the previous one. You can see they've changed the paint scheme. And I really think that the paint scheme on this looks beautiful, actually. Really a lot better than the previous version that they had released prior to this. But again, I was really hoping for maybe a totally new sculpt, not rearing up like this one is or anything, but I'm still really happy to have a new Diplodocus from Collect Day, and I really do quite like the paint scheme a lot more on this one than the previous one, so I may not be as excited about this as I am about the others, but why would you not be excited about a new sauropod figure regardless? So that is all the 2020 Collect Day figure releases for this year. Let me know in the comments, guys, what you guys think of all of them, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.